Yes, sir, YouTube. What is going on, everyone? And welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another reaction. We have Led Zeppelin. Led Zeppelin 1969. I like the I like the album name. It's just Led Zeppelin. Let's uh let's get into it. This will be the first official album. We've only done one song. Led Zeppelin is a debut state studio album by English rock band Led Zeppelin. It was released on uh it was released on 12th of January 1969. Let's look at the artwork real quick. Led Zeppelin's front cover, which was chosen by Page, features a black and white image of the burning Hindenburg airship photographed by Sam Shear on May 6, 1937, during the Hindenburg disaster. The Hindenburg disaster was an airship accident that occurred on May 6 in Manchester Township, New Jersey, United States. Hmm, it's kind of interesting, huh? Is all new to me. Let me see real quick. It's 1937, and you're just an average German who has won the opportunity of a lifetime. First class accommodations aboard Nazi Germany's premier airship, the Hindenburg. The oh, Hindenburg damn. is the height of luxury. A 60 plus flight veteran of the world's first airline, Delog, which stands for something in German that we don't feel our narrator gets paid enough to pronounce. Oh, She's that's that's crazy. That's a crazy uh, album cover then. <clears throat> I did hit the dispensary as well. I hit I hit the um I hit the garden. AKA the dispensary, man. We got her some fresh, fresh green. Smells amazing. Looks amazing. Let's keep going. Sports a luxury cabin for every one of her passengers, and she's also the fastest way to cross the Atlantic and get to America. Gee whiz bang, you say to yourself in Nazi, the opportunity of a lifetime. But wait, you think? Isn't hydrogen a highly flammable gas that could end in catastrophic incineration of the airship and a horrible fiery death for all of her crew and guests? Nah, <laughs> you decide it's 1930 <laughs> and man is a technological god by now. I knew about this, so this is awesome right here. A little bit of, uh, a bit of knowledge. These are the landing lines. From the initial burst until the ship crashes in a burning heap on the ground. Folks, between us, this is terrible. This is the worst of the worst catastrophes in the world. Oh, the humanity. Oh, damn. After the accident, there were many many theories espoused sabotage only 32 66 of 97 aboard escaped death in the fire Scenarios include somebody firing a gun with an incendiary bullet from the woods around the airfield, but there was very little validity to it that anybody knew of. What scientists now believe happened is that a tear in a gas bag, a hydrogen leak, an electrostatic charge, and a rare spark between the outer skin and the inner frame all added up to a once in a lifetime chain reaction yo we're gonna have to look into this a little bit later let's jump into this album man good times bad times come on chat we gotta turn this up very excited for this one I think this is just how it starts. Also got some I got some lyrics on this side as well. Track listing going. No matter how I try, find my way to 
Ooh. Ooh. Hold on. Let's go back a little bit. That was a cool change. Let me see. Good times, bad times. Hmm. When my woman left home for a brown eyed man, but I still didn't seem to care. It was good times and bad times. an intro jimmy page i was reading a little bit of, about him right before i turned on the camera jimmy jimmy page i heard he's a fucking legend Jimmy Page, here we go. He's also the founder of Led Zeppelin. Oh man, buckle up. Babe, I'm gonna leave you is the next one. That was filthy. <laughs> Absolutely filthy. Like the chords. You know I'm gonna leave you. I'm leave you when the summer time. Leave you when the summer comes around. Mm. Breden.
calling me the way it used to do. I can hear it calling me back home. Damn, what a voice. Oh, this is insane. <laughs> Got to quit you. It was good to have you back again, and I know that one day, baby, it's going to really grow you. I'm going to go walking through the park every day. Oh my god, this is a beauty. <laughs> Kinda sad, but it's a beauty. folk song written by Anne Breddon in the late 50s. Mm. Joanne Bays recorded a solo version. Okay, it's very styles, including Led Zeppelin. Wow. Wow.
a lot of like different uh guitar riffs throughout the entire song they tune it to the right they'll tune it to the left you you shook me Mm. You know you shook me. You shook me all night long. You know you shook me, baby. You shook me all night long. You like blues, huh? I'm about blues. That was a sick drum break.
<laughs> Back and forth. Mm. You suck me. Oh, 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 <laughs> Yo, absolutely filthy. Robert Plant, English singer and songwriter, best known for the leader of Led Zeppelin. That was inducted into the band. <clears throat> was inducted with the band into the rock. Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in 95. And joined, uh, enjoyed great success with Led Zeppelin from the late 60s to the end of the 70s. <clears throat> Developed a compelling image as a charismatic rock and roll frontman, similar to those of contemporaries such as Mick Jagger of the Rolling Stones, Roger and Jim Morris, Freddie Mercury. Yo, I wonder if there's like a live version to this as well. Cause imagine seeing that harmonica. That was that's insane. Each song keeps getting more and more out of this world. That was you shook me. You look it up real quick. Looks like there's like some kind of controversy during that song too. You shook me. Yeah, I think they do. You shook me, 93 in Montreal. Oh, ho, we might have to check this out after. Dazed and confused. That's the next one. Hmm. of a woman was created below oh wow yo we gotta 
Hold on, chat. We gotta hear that. What? We gotta hear that little. Go back a little bit more. Hmm. Every day I work so hard, bringing home my heart and pain. Try to love you, baby, but you push me away. Don't know. Yo.
Hold on, hold on. I need to catch my breath. This is this is insane. I don't even have a button. This is not. This is past absolutely uh, filthy. Uh, absolutely filthy. Man. I can't wait to see like some of these live. It's going to be it's going to be insane. He's in confused. You can hear the different so many melodies. That guitar, those drums, that voice. Damn. Hard hitting. Go back. Insane. Absolutely. <laughs> side two, side two, chat. We're gonna flip the record over. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Give me some more water. I'll be back in a minute. It's filthy. I forgot I watched this. <laughs> Man, what a great album so far. Halfway there. Your time is going to come. Mm. Oh, man. 
Keep it rocking. Dazed and confused. Dazed and confused. Editor, please cut that up. Wow, well, that'd be a solo reaction. Come in so powerful. Lying, cheating, hurting. That's all you seem to do. Messing around every guy in town. Putting me down for thinking of someone new. Time is gonna come.
the song for the boys. Black Mountain Side. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, before we get into that one. That's a cool, uh, solo. It's inspired by a traditional Irish folk song called Down by Blackwater Side. The, the guitar arrangement closely follows Bert and version. The song recorded in 66. Hmm, earlier, I don't know where I was looking, where they showed, uh, they showed his guitar, the one that I used for a certain, I forgot where it was. I was hoping they would have that for this one. Took me days and confused. Yeah, where was it? I don't know. Somewhere, somewhere. All right. So the next one would be uh, communication breakdown. Such an amazing voice. I'm 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 gonna restart this one real quick. It's just not a kick off a song. It's the lead single from their debut album, Led Zeppelin. An instant classic.
song has been recognized by acts such as Iron Maiden, Soundgarden, and Dread Zeppelin. Man, I can't be I can't believe they're doing this in the late sixties. It's so fucking good. You guys are telling me there's five more albums? Six more? How many more? Like five, six more? Not only that, but you guys tell me like this is there's people in the chat that have been like I'm not a huge fan of all, you know, their music, but I'm a big fan and I love everything Led Zeppelin. So I, I dove into a pink Pink Floyd hole for a little bit. I'm still there, man. Pink Floyd. So some Led Zeppelin. If we get this. Ooh, another Man, cause you just dive into those, you know, those rabbit holes sometimes and you just, you just want to learn. You want to know more about them. Instinct classic is what they call it. <laughs> Absolutely filthy. Beauty. Definitely a beauty. <laughs> Recording. On. So there's the genre is hard rock and blues rock. Hard rock, blues rock. The producer's Jimmy Page as well. 
He's handling everything then. He's holding it down. Yo, Jimmy Page is nasty. Damn. Nobody home. The discography. Let me look real quick, chat. I know I'm stopping a lot. Led Zeppelin, Led Zeppelin 2, Led Zeppelin 3, another Led Zeppelin. Four. Okay, so Led Zeppelin 4. I didn't read the bottom number. Zeppelin 3, Zeppelin 4, Houses of the Holy, Physical Graffiti, damn, In Through the, In Through the Outdoor, 1, 2, 3, they still got like 7 more albums, I'm gonna have to knock these out. These guys are filthy. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> filthy, Absolutely chat. filthy. All right, let's get into the next one. I can't quit you, baby. I, I can't quit you, baby. The soul hits the soul. Thank you. 
<laughs> oh my goodness. You know it hurts me deep down inside. When you hear me moaning and groaning, babe. You know it hurts me deep down inside. When you hear me moaning and groaning, baby, you know it hurts me deep down inside. Oh, when you hear me moaning and groaning, you know you're my one desire. It's scary. This is scary. Scary. Good. How many more times? Should we, oh, I don't know if we should find a. Live to this one. And Mark's radio sixty nine. Thank you very much. I'd like to introduce Led Zeppelin to you. On bass guitar, John Paul Jones. John Paul Jones. On drums, John Bonham. Big guitar, Jimmy Page. Bonzo, right? I think his name is Bonzo. And myself, Robert Plant. Jimmy Page. Okay. Okay. Give you all I've got to give. 
<laughs> That's wicked. Got a big old smile right now. He's nasty.
A hunter? Oh, this is dope. hope i didn't kill the vibe with throwing in the video but i think it was actually good that we threw it on you know they introduced themselves in the beginning let me see thank you very much I forgot the bass's name i'd like to introduce led zeppelin to you yeah. on bass guitar john paul jones john paul jones john paul jones on drums John Bonham. He was filthy too. Jimmy Page. Big guitar, Jimmy Page. And myself, Robert Plant. This is a scary group right here. I think Jimmy Page put some of his own money, um, put his money where his mouth is. He bet it all on himself. Jimmy Page, the group's founder, leading guitarist, manager. Let me see. The sessions took place before the group had secured a recording contract and total, totaled 36 hours that were paid for directly by Jimmy Page, the group's founder, lead and guitarist and Led Zeppelin's manager, Peter Grant, and cost 31,000 euros. So I, I would guess that's like, what, $35,000? The 
this is some scary guitar playing. Scary band overall. They slow they can slow it down and then they speed it back up. They got melodies all over the place. Holy. Can't wait to watch some of these um some of these lives. I can't wait to jump into some of these lives. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the reaction, the experience with me, my first time watching, listening, watching, listening to a full album by Led Zeppelin. I'm officially hooked. I want to see what they do like next. I want to see what they're next. Like going into the seventies. What's that like? All right, guys, drop it down in the comments. Let me know. I think we just, I think we just keep going, right? We just do. Let me know if there's like some really good solos, maybe some good uh, solo reactions or any lives. All right, hit them. Hit me, hit me with them down at the comments. Hit that like. Hit that sub. If you're new here, hit that sub. All right, guys, I'm out of here. I'll see you on the next one. I'm out. Peace.